There's something miraculous about the monarch butterfly. Even if you don't believe in God, the phenomenon of the monarch butterfly makes you start thinking about what God is all about, because it's just magical. Its colors, the sound of the wings beating, it's profoundly soothing. Gloria Tavera has been in charge of the Monarch Butterfly Biosphere Reserve in Michoacán, Mexico, for years. But even so, the annual arrival of millions of butterflies still astonishes her. They have a journey of over 4,000 kilometers behind them. The migration spans three countries, Canada, the U.S. and Mexico. The monarch butterfly is the only insect to cover such a vast distance in such a short space of time. It raises many questions. How is it they always come to the same place, although they've never been there before? They're the offspring of the offspring of the butterflies that laid their eggs in the spring. That's what's so extraordinary about the phenomenon. No butterfly ever does the journey twice. The monarch butterflies are obviously beautiful, but do they actually matter to the ecosystem? They certainly do. A pilot project sponsored by Germany and organized by the International Climate Initiative is designed to back up their relevance with statistics. The monarch butterfly is a symbol. For locals, it's a natural jewel. But it also plays a role in the tree's absorption of CO2, the nutrient cycle, the regulation of water, and many other natural processes underway in the forest and mountains. Its economic value is obvious. The monarch butterflies are a major tourist draw. It's just amazing to learn that they can fly such distances. It's wonderful to be here and see the butterflies in their natural habitat. It's magical, like a fairy tale forest. Tourism provides the communities close to where the monarch butterflies winter with an income. Protecting the forests, therefore, amounts to protecting their livelihoods. But as far as other local communities are concerned, there is no financial gain in leaving the forest untouched. To us, the butterflies are a natural spectacle. When they arrive every year, the children come to see them. But unfortunately, they don't help us earn a living. Unless that changes, the monarch butterflies might find their winter quarters under threat. For now, the cost-benefit ratio doesn't make sense. The local population shoulders the cost of conservation, forfeiting work and income by leaving the area untouched. That's what we call opportunity cost. People in the region are losing out on intensive forestry opportunities and they need to be compensated. For now, this isn't happening. Some people, meanwhile, benefit greatly from the conservation of the forest, even if they don't realize how much and certainly don't pay for the privilege but they get to enjoy fresh water that comes from the forest, for example. The water doesn't come out of the tap. It comes from the mountains. People use it for farming, and the people in the cities use it too, even in Mexico City. Their drinking water comes from here. So the monarch butterflies play a key role in generating income and within the ecosystem 
and also help put food on people's plates, not just in Mexico. Pollination serves a vital function. It's the cornerstone of agriculture in the Great Plains of the U.S. It's a process that humans will never be able to replicate. It cannot be automated. We need to realize this. There are natural phenomena we will never be able to simulate, however much we spend on trying to. It's hard to put a price tag to something irreplaceable. But that's exactly what the German aid agency GIZ is trying to do. Determine the actual value for North America of the services provided by the butterflies. Ultimately, this will mean that the beneficiaries of the monarch butterfly phenomenon will pay their fair share. It will only work if the benefits and yields of the ecosystem are redistributed. By an environmental fund or via fees, for example. But the symbolic value of these butterflies is priceless. I always say we should all be more like monarch butterflies. They brave dangers, they work together, they can look after themselves, form teams, make group decisions about their survival, and their stamina is inspirational.